I found the thieves responsible for the cargo thefts. I put them out of business. Excellent. With that resolved, the mine's profits will soar. For now, partner, please be sure to visit our workers occasionally. You have a knack for keeping them happy. It is apparently not enough that the Kunari define my political life. They must also infect what I hold personal. It is my son, Seamus. The life you saved, he would now squander by converting to the Kun. He has left for the Kunari compound. Please, Sarah Hawk, convince Seamus to come home. He is of age. The decision seems rightly his. I want to let him find his way, but in my position, he's taken a great deal of inspiration from you. I want to allow his idealism, but not blindly. At best, my opponents will claim that my office is now in Canari hands. At worst, I lose my son. The Arashok says nothing good about Kirkwall, yet he accepts conversions? I cannot understand him. Maker knows I've tried, but he landed with, what, a few hundred men? Add up the deaths and defections, and the Arishok must need to bolster his ranks. I'm sure my son is quite the symbolic prize. Did anyone else see him leaving for the compound? He made no secret of it. I'm sure he intended it as another of his statements about closer relations. Your example inspired him. I might agree, but now is not the time. These matters are... delicate. He's politically dangerous, you mean? The office must remain strong, Sir Arhawk. You know this will only end in trouble. Fitting. That's where it started. My son is not foolish. He will listen to reason, and you are in the best position to offer that opportunity. Please, do what you can. Anti-Canari? Anti-Viscount? Or Seamus himself not wanting to be rescued? Seamus isn't the type. Let's go. Sarah Hawk. I'm here about the Viscount's son. Are you? In four years, I have made no threat 
And fanatics have lined up to hate us simply because we exist. But despite lies and fear, Baas still beg me to let them come to the Kune. They hunger for purpose. The Sun has made a choice. You will not deny him that. No doubt you see the advantage of having the Viscount's son at arm's reach. He is no longer the Viscount's son. Vidithari give up their lives for the certainty only Kunari know. You would not take advantage of his connections? The Kuhn may demand that advantage, but I do not. It was his choice to be educated. He is not my prisoner. He is not even here. He went to his father. Ask the Viscount why he would send you and the letter both. That seems strange. They are meeting at the Chantry. A last pointless appeal, I assume. The Viscount would involve the Chantry? No, but we know who would. Mother Patrice. A suspect in many things. If she has threatened someone under my command again, there is only one response. Don't make things worse by marching your men through the streets without cause. This is cause. This is the last insult I will suffer, Hawk. I will be watching. Vidathari are of the Kuhn. This offense will have an answer. Sirrah, Hawk. The sun has made a cho- The Kuhn. He went to his father. A suspect. If she has threatened someone... The... 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 Sarah Hawk, look at what you have done. To pounce upon the Viscount's son, a repentant convert in the Chantry itself. A crime with no excuse. Your Kunari masters will finally answer. You've been a headache. But to outright kill someone? That's new for you. He deliberately denied the Maker. How many would follow if he went unpunished? And yet, even this sympathizer will inspire vengeance when his brutal murder is exposed. You won't get the Kunari ousted. You'll get a slaughter. On both sides. To die untested would be the real crime. People need the opportunity to defend faith, starting with you. Earn your reward in this life and next. These heretics must die! Grace? Traitors attacking the very core of the Chantry. They defile with every step. There is death in every corner, young mother. It is as you predicted. All too well. 
Forgive me, Your Grace. But you must know the truth about what happened here. Don't you spout your Kunari filth! This is a hand of the Divine! I have ears, Mother Patrice. The Maker would have me use them. Sarah Hawk, is it? Viscount Dumas' son is dead. Killed here in your name. I'm sure my name won't like that. Patrice? Seamus Dumas was a Canari convert. He came here to repent and was murdered. It's a ruse, Your Grace. Seamus was killed to set people against the Canari. This is no longer a matter of heathens squatting in the docks. People are leaving us to join them. And we must pray for them like any other. They deny the Maker. And you diminish him, even as you claim his side. Andraste did not volunteer for the flame. Sarah Hawk, you act on behalf of the Viscount? The young mother has erred in her judgment. A court will decide her fate. The Chantry respects the law, and so must she. Grand Cleric? Grand Cleric? We protect those of the Kune. We do not abandon our own. Please, send for Viscount Dumas. My son. Murdered in the heart of the Chantry by those who held a sacred trust. What hope for this city when we fail our own so completely? The Arashok is still here, Excellency. You must be ready to stand up to him. I cannot. I have already failed where it mattered most. Please. Hawk. Leave me. An end of sorts. But the Canari and the Chantry and the Viscount's dead son won't simply fade from memory. Nobody came out of that looking good. What now? Not our move. We wait to see what the Arashok does. This is important. Don't interrupt with your selfish prattle. Get off your high horse. I have problems, too. Ha! <laughs> what drink should I order, and who's the father? Oh, you little... What is it now, you two? Hawk. The Arashok is sheltering two fugitives who have converted to the Kune. He must be convinced to release them. He's already feared because of Patrice. If people start to think he can ignore the law, I need your help so this doesn't get out of hand. I'm going to die. There. Got your attention. Real problem. But hold on. What's this about? Remember the relic? The one Castillon is going to kill me over? A man called Wall-Eyed Sam has it. If you help me get it, Castillon won't kill me. Please. I'm trying to keep the entire city from rioting against the Canari. Well, 
Maybe it's connected. What? I'm just saying, maybe it will help. It's important to someone, right? Now you start being responsible? Shit. This seems like an issue for you and your guards. <laughs> Quite a few of them. Sending a full patrol would just increase tension. But you're right. I am the captain. It's my responsibility. But... I suspect the Viscount was hoping I would bring this to you. Then he should have come himself. Perhaps. But it's understandable that he's not at his best. I'd like to help him if I can. Isn't it odd that someone would run to the Kunari? They're elves accused of murder. Maybe they feel they've nothing to lose by fleeing the alienage. And if their conversion is genuine? I don't know. But how many more will try if I allow this? Justice must be respected. You're expecting trouble? After what happened to the Viscount's son? Yes. I'm hoping the Canari aren't looking for a fight. I'm hoping they'll be reasonable. But we'll see. Why has this come up so suddenly, Isabella? Sam's been talking to black market dealers all over Lowtown. It didn't take me long to get wind of it. What frustrates me is that he's held onto the relic so long. Tell me about Sam. Sam used to run with Martin. Remember him? Martin says Sam's a bit of a magpie, picking up things that don't belong to him. Not a trustworthy sort. When Martin gave up raiding, Sam became a drifter. Who is involved in this exchange? Tevinter mages. I doubt they'll look kindly on us interrupting. Bring a sword, or twelve. You're sure this is the relic you're after? I've had my ear to the ground for a while. There was a description of the book. It's the right one. Book? I thought you didn't know what the relic was. Well, I... I, I know it's a book, but that's all I know. It's written in a foreign tongue. Honestly, what does it matter? It'll save me from Castillon, so I need it. The relic issue has to be resolved before we take on the Kunari. You trust her this much? Probably not. I wouldn't. They won't wait at the compound forever, Hawk. I really do hope this helps, because if it doesn't... You think I like having this thing on my mind? Come on. The exchange is happening tonight in a low-town foundry. Are you sure about this? The champion was asked to go to the Canari. I suppose you think she planned the entire thing. Considering what it led to. Come on, Seeker. I'm not going to sell Hawk short. But nobody could have foreseen the way that that would go down. Or do you still think I'm lying to protect my friend? There are elements of your story that make sense. And you couldn't have known about them otherwise. Well, that's a relief. But that doesn't mean you're telling me everything. I want this story to be told. You're not the first to get it all wrong. I think I owe Hawk that much. Surrender the relic. I don't have your stupid relic. The bond has a <laughs> What are the Kunari doing here? Uh, yes. About that. 
the relic belongs to the Canari, and there's a small chance they want it back. Tell me what you know. You can trust me. I've always known what the relic is. I just didn't want to worry you. You're the picture of kindness, Ravani. The relic is a Canari text handwritten by that philosopher of theirs. Uh, Keslan, Kuzland, whatever his name is. I stole it from them. They followed me here to reclaim it, and it's why they're still in Kirkwall. They can't leave the free marches without it. I thought you and the Kunari were caught in a storm. The storm was only half of it. I also had the Kunari Dreadnought stuck to my behind like a bad rash, spitting fire and thunder at me. Maybe giving it back would solve Aveline's problem. That mess is over a couple of elves. I need it to save my own skin. Why would anyone besides the Kunari want this relic? The Tevinta Imperium have been at war with the Kunari for centuries. If the Tevintas get the relic, it will strike a blow to Kunari morale. That's probably what the mages want. How did you steal the relic from the Kunari? The Arashok never had it. The Orlesians did. They had plans to return it to the Canari. I simply had to waylay the Orlesian convoy before it met up with the Arashok and his men. Getting the relic was easy. Getting away from the Canari was the hard part. You could have done something about the Canari, but you didn't. Done what? The blighted thing didn't show up for three years. Look. The book's right in this building, and I'm not letting it slip away again. It's the only thing that'll get Castillon off my back. Please, tell me you'll give the relic to me. The artifact belongs to the Canari, and you'll let them leave with it. Don't you understand? The relic is the only thing that will keep Castillon from feeding me to the sharks. I can't believe you're... Oh! <sighs> Fine. You're right. I'll return the relic. It'll go straight to the Canari once we get it. Come on, we've no time to waste. Where is the relic? I... uh... I have it! The Tome of Koslan will not fall into Deventer hands! Blood and spite! A touch Canari! He's getting away! Isabella! Let's <laughs> go.